एस चांद प्रेजेंट्स एजुकेशनल वीडियो लेक्चर्स एस पर दी ए आई सी टी ई कारिकुलम डिफिकल्ट कॉन्सेप्ट मेड इजी स्टडी एनी वेयर एनी टाइम Welcome to West Chand Academy, and we are on the second part of the video, which is the power tools. In the first part of the video, we learnt about the hacksaw. Now, in the second part of the video, we'll be learning about the other power tools. Hello, everyone. I am Anmol Bhatia, and welcome to West Chand Academy. For detailed conceptual clarity, you can refer to the book by S. Chand Publishing. The link of the book is there in the description box below. We will be learning the topic power tools, and this is the second part of the video uh, of the course manufacturing practices. So till now we have seen the operations of power hexa. Now in this part of the video, we will be learning about the other power tools. and the other power tools are these three which are which are namely the circular saw the drilling machine and the grinding machine so firstly let us understand what is a circular saw a circular saw as the name suggests it has a circular tool with the help of that circular tool we can we are able to cut the material the material that can be cut with the help of a circular saw is primarily wood and with the help of certain exchange of the material of the tool we can uh, we can cut the other materials as well i wanted to show you a circular saw blade which is used in this operation so this is a circular saw blade which is used in this operation as you can see that this tool is in circular shape and it has cutting edges with the help of those cutting edges we can able to cut the material uh, primarily it is used for the wood working operations the machine that you can see on the other half of the screen is a circular saw machine and the operation that the operator is performing is the sawing operation the cutting is taking place with the help of the circular saw and you can see the operation on the half part of the screen now coming to the second power tool which is the drilling machine so as the name is suggesting that the drilling machine is used to drill the hole on the surface of either wood or on the metal so you might have seen the drilling machine which can be operated with the help of the hand or which can be operated using a manual operation but this drilling machine that i am talking about is generally power driven with the help of electric power so here what happens this drilling machine is used to drill the holes on the surface of the workpiece and the angle of the bit which is used to remove the material is generally 118 degrees so the drill bit which is used to drill uh, the hole on the surface that is having an angle which is 118 degree coming to the constructional details of the drilling machine you can see the diagram of the drilling machine on the screen in which it has a table and there is a table clamp the place where we want to uh, stop the table is there now a drill bit is attached to the spindle which in turn is attached to the spindle head and there is a feed handle which is used to move this uh, spindle head downward or upward in both the directions and it has a stepped pulley which is connected to the motor so here you can see that the motor gives the power to a pulley and with the help of the belt it is being transferred to the second pulley which is in turn connected to the spindle head which rotates the drilling bit so drilling bit would come into the rotational uh, motion and when it comes in contact with the workpiece which is placed on the surface of this table a drill can be obtained the machine that you you can see on the screen is the drilling machine the operation of the drilling machine as i have told you with the help of the diagram is illustrated with the help of this video in which you can see that the operator is moving that handle which is connected to the spindle head and that moves in the downward manner to drill the hole on the surface of the workpiece so the power is uh, being given to the uh pulley and with which in turn gives the power to the spindle head and that uh, is connected to the drill bit which moves in the downward direction and the rotary motion 
which is there with the help with which is there in in the drill bit is in contact with the workpiece so that a drill is obtained on the surface so so far we have learned about the circular saw and the drilling machine now the last uh, thing that we will be covering as a part of this power tool is the grinding machine so as the name suggests grinding machine is a kind of machine which is used to remove the material and from where it is used to remove the material the material which would be having a low surface finish so a material which is having a low surface finish that is uh, in connection with the grinding wheel uh, will create a surface which would be having a higher surface finish as compared to the previous version so the grinding wheel is there as a tool in the grinding machine and this grinding wheel is a kind of a multi point cutting tool that has high material removal rate so here basically you have a grinding wheel and that grinding wheel is a multi point cutting tool which which when comes in contact with the workpiece will create the surface finish on the surface of the workpiece so here majorly what we want we want a good surface finish on the surface so for that we have a power tool which is the grinding machine the operation that you are watching on the screen is the grinding operation the machine is majorly a handheld grinder in which the operator is uh, making the grinding wheel to come in contact with the workpiece and when it comes in contact with the workpiece smaller chips are being produced and the arcs or the sparks that you are seeing on the screen when it comes in contact with the workpiece that is majorly the chip and majorly majority of the heat is there inside the chip that's why that particular chip part is hot and it is appearing brighter so in order to have a good surface finish the grinding machine is being used so far we have covered all these uh, three types of power tools in this part of the video in the circular saw we have seen that the operation would have a circular blade and the cutting operation is majorly for the wood for the drilling machine we have seen that it is a a machine which is uh, operated by um, the electrical uh, drive or you can say a motor so motor drives the pulley and ultimately the drill is being rotated and when the drill comes in contact with the workpiece operation the drilling operation takes place in the grinding machine basically what happens it has a multi point cutting tool which is a grinding wheel which when comes in contact with the workpiece uh, would create a surface which has a good surface finish but that grinding wheel is attached to the motor which rotates that uh, grinding wheel uh, so that a particular motion is obtained with this we come to the end of the second part of the video in which we have learnt the power tools namely the circular saw the drilling machine and the grinding machine for detailed conceptual clarity you can refer to the book by s chand publishing the link of the book is there in the description box below if you find the video interesting like share subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon for future updates thank you all rights reserved this video has been prepared for educational purposes only no part of it may be reproduced or copied without the permission of the copyright holder